The annual digital news report by the Reuters Institute for the Study of Journalism, or RISJ, finds the Philippines' media landscape, despite the change in leadership in 2022, remains largely grim. The report notes 75 cases of violations of press freedom under Marcus's rule. Red tagging remains a tool to harass and silence journalists, including ABS-CBN, Rappler, Bulatlat, and the National Union of Journalists of the Philippines. Ironically, far-right broadcast network SMNI, which red tags journalists and activists, is included in the rankings. The RISJ also reports on the trust scores for media outlets, but says, quote, scores should not be seen as a measure of trustworthiness of the content. RISJ's table and accompanying graphics are used in information operations to tear down the credibility of news organizations. Rappler CEO and Nobel Peace Prize laureate Maria Ressa says the 2023 RISJ report is like giving a loaded gun to autocratic governments trying to silence independent journalists. Music